Hi there, cupcakes! Welcome to another episode of Omega Ruby Wedlock! Uh, so, yes, this last episode actually, we uh, went and defeated uh, Roxanne, the rock type gym leader, and we saved Pico from uh, the Magma peoples. Team Magma. <laughs> uh, so now we're going to go and return the Devon parts back to this lovely researcher who I cannot remember what his voice is. So uh, just before we go, I'll just uh, show you my Pokemon. I did a little bit of training up. All my Pokemon are now level four 14 except for Borgsai who's level 12 because I had to do very low level training so that I wouldn't meet something that he couldn't, uh, yeah, he couldn't handle. So level 14 is pretty good I think since uh, I think the next gym leader Brawly is like level 16 and I don't think there's you do very much in between. So we got, we're gonna put Jasper at the front. Actually, should we arrange it so Borksite is at the bottom? So Amethyst oops, is next to. I just like them being next to each other. I think it's sweeter that way. This D pad is so sensitive. Um, so yeah, let's go and talk to this guy. Oh, did you get it? How did it go? Did you get my Devon parts? You did. You got them back. You really are a great trainer. I know, I'll give you a great ball as thanks. I obtained a great ball, even though I brought like five of them from the Pokemon. Oh, look at this big building. So he's gonna do go and take us to someone special. I'm not sure who's the special person we're gonna meet. This is the top floor of the Devon Corporation. Our president's office is on this floor. I can't tell you how grateful I am for what you've done for this company. Could you wait here a moment? Okay, sure. I can't remember his voice. <laughs> Whoops. Our president would like to have a word with you. Come with me. Okay. What a lovely floor he has. Please, go ahead. Alrighty then. I'm, I'm Mr. Stone, the president of Devon Corporation. I heard just now how you have, uh, how, how we have quite a bit to thank you for. So you helped out my staff not just once, but twice. Here's a favor I'd like to ask of a reliable trainer like you. Now I want you to know I'm a, tres a president, a president you can trust. I've never been so mean as to ask a favor for nothing in return. Here, give me your Pokenav Plus for a moment. Mr. Stone updated your poking out plus. <laughs> I love my narrative voice. This function I just added to your poking out plus. Ooh, this I'm channeling a little bit of um, Brendan there. This function I added to your poking out plus is called Buzznav. It's an indispensable tool for any trainer who's traveling in the world. Use it, and you'll be able to get the latest news from around the region and from your friends anytime, any place. Now let me get to the important issue of what I need you to do. I want to ask you to deliver this letter to a man named Stephen. You should find him in Duford. Casey, I tamed the letter. Casey put the letter in the key item bucket. You have to cross the sea to reach Duford, of course. I'll ask Mr. Briney, the old sealer who lives in hut, uh, in that hut on Route 104, to help with crossing the ocean. Go find him, and he should agree to help you. I'm counting on you, young lady. If you're ever unsure what to do, just come and ask me... Ah, uh, talk with me again. Okay. If you say so. So, oh, he's got so many stones. Oh, what is this a note I can read? Nope. Hi, I'm the receptionist for Mr. Stone. Could you just take a mo uh, seat, please? He needs another moment. That's my receptionist voice. Uh, very pretty stones. So now we're gonna go and do. I was actually really. Oops, no, I don't wanna work here. I was actually talking to these people. Is it any. I want that table, by the way. That is such a cool table. The Pokeball table. Um, I was really looking forward to going and getting another Pokemon for Bauxite. Uh, but we actually have some things to do this episode. Uh, things that I missed out on last time 
So we're gonna go and explore some areas and fight some people. I love this. This is so cool. Look at this. Ah, so awesome. Um, so actually, oh. Huh? Hey, Casey, how's your Pokedex, com Pokedex completed any entries yet? Mine pretty much rules. I went on a Pokemon catching frenzy in Petalburg Woods until I ran out of Pokeballs. Oh yeah, I passed Mr. Briny. I bet he was on his way home to the cottage on Route 104. I guess you wouldn't, have, wouldn't know since you just moved here and all, but they say that old guy used to be an amazing sailor. That's all you're here for? Really? Your job here is just to illiterate? <laughs> just to retell us that we need to go to room 104? Very nice, okay. Very lame. <laughs> so mean. I'm sorry, Brendan. <laughs> so let's see what Pokemon we have out front. Um, yeah, let's use this couple. Uh, so up here is some cool stuff that... Oh, actually, I want to check out this feature. Welcome to Buzznav. Buzznav brings you the latest buzz around the horn the street pass. Yeah, right, fire it up. Uh, okay. Uh, alright. Uh, you really. Can we just end this? Thank you, M. Uh, this is a Haitian people napping incident that became the top headline not long ago. Has been resolved with brave actions of one young trainer. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Oh, that's really cool. Oh, that is really cool, that thing at the bottom. <laughs> Everyone's keeping an eye on my future. So, here. So, we cut this. I, maybe I should turn, uh, my, oh, Bogside's on the news. Oh, yes, Bogside, this Pokemon with a nickname tells me that this is one thoughtful Pokemon. Oh. Oh, that's so sweet. I, it's kind of distracting, so I have to turn it off now. <laughs> um, but that's really sweet. Oh, I didn't have cut. Hang on. That's why I haven't been up here. I didn't teach my Pokemon cut. So only one Pokemon can use cut at the moment. That sucks. So would I like to teach it to Jasper? Yes, I would. What should I delete? Uh, I guess Scratch? I really hate the 95% accuracy. That is just silly. Uh, so now we can cut down bushes. So let's do this. Do I like to use cut? Hell yeah! Thank you very much, Jasper. And there's some Pokemon trainers here, which should we fight them? I oh, know that wasn't. Oh, my D pad sucks so much. Uh, I want to go to my Pokemon and check I've got, oh, I've got Jasper out. Mm, yeah, alright. Let's get them up a few levels. Let's talk to this guy. We learn all sorts of things at the training school. I want to test things out for real. Alright. Let's test it. Huh? Rods. Everyone in this game has a rods except for me. Go Jasper! You're gonna end this thing so when I I can feel it. Level 10? Psh. Let's peck. Actually, I wanted to use Ember, but I'm gonna peck. Double team. Oh, lame. I'm a little bit, <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> I'm jeering uh, a lot of Pokemon on this time around. <laughs> I'm a nice person normally. Yay, Rob's fa fainted. Oh, uh, yay, we defeated him. And I, Did it just say 200? I hope it said 200. I thought it said 2,000. And I was like, hmm, what's this sign say? Trainer tips. You know, bag a seven or Oh, blah, blah, blah. Uh, let's go up here. Is there anything up here? No? Oh, it's just a way to skip him. Okay, and I guess this is a way to skip her as well. You know what? Let's fight with Amethyst. Show us what you're made of, Amethyst. Looking forward to getting those Chester berries. I study in school. I study on the way home too. Uh, I think I like this music a little bit too much. Shroomish! Amethyst is going to end you with a gust. So, should we confusion or gust? Mm, I think 
confusion is 50 and I think Gust is 40, so less confusion actually. Oh well, I should have used Gust. Oh, but I confused it at least. <laughs> That's good. Oh, and it hit itself. That's nice. That is really nice. Good job, Amethyst. You're a kicking butt. Let's see how much your Gust does. Way more. Shroomish fated. I tell you what, it's really nice. A Wisma. Let's switch to Jasper. It's really nice to be higher level than everything else because the last couple of episodes we've been about the same level as things that we've been fighting. Um, let's ember this thing. Let's see how much damage that does. Quite a bit. Oh, it pounded me. It's such got cute little hands. It doesn't look like it could pound me very hard. Oh, that sounded wrong. Oops. I love Wisma. It doesn't, it's so cute in its first evolution. Uh, and I can't wait to use Boxite in a pair with someone. So let's cut this. Yes, I would love to. Go Jasper. And let's pick up this Pokeball and try not to fall off the edge in Ether. And some Chesto Berries, which is cool. I much prefer to use berries. That way I don't have to pay for them. Actually, that reminds me, I have a lot of Pokemon I need to pick up on our way down uh, because, not Pokemon, berries. I like to plant a lot of berries and in between episodes I plant berries and I think they might be grown by now. So we've done everything in Rustboro City. So goodbye city, it's been lovely being here. Thank you for having me. Au revoir. Sayonara. Uh, so our first lot of berries is here and I actually got a raw berry. 16 berries? Oh my gosh, so if you water them all the time you get 16 berries. I don't want to plant a berry. I'm not going to be here for a while. Uh, take the orange berry? Yes please. So if you water them consistently you get 16? That is nice. No, I don't want to plant a berry. I want to just do pad. Oh, oh, my screen. I need to turn off the so my screen from going black. Cause it's like you're not recording. You've just been staring at a screen for 14 minutes. You must not want to look at it. Uh, so let's go back down here and oh, prickly bush we can cut. Let's cut this one. Uh, and what are we gonna get? A revive, which is useless to me. Uh, in some playthroughs, I like to do this rule like you only get so many revives as you get uh, that you pick up. So you can't revive at a Pokemon Center, you can only use revives that you pick up and not ones that you buy. Uh, which is nice if you like want it kind of a cushy, easier. But I kind of prefer them being dead, dead, you know. But that is a variation you can use. So. Let's continue through here because I at least want to get to Mr. Briny's cottage before this episode ends. So let's just cut. There's a lot of places you can go now with this cut. So what is up here? Oh, is that someone you can battle? No, it isn't. Oh, the thing you have is a Pokenav Plus. It means you're a trainer. Then you should try this item. A Miracle Seed. Thank you. Oh my god, that Miracle Seed would be awesome on... Uh, Jade, but Jade has a, a quick claw. Maybe a quick claw is a bit better. That's not the one I want. Powers up grass type. Mm. Yeah, let's give it to Jade. Because a quick claw isn't always guaranteed, so that's nice. And oh, there's the mossy stone. Another great ball. Uh, so if we get an Eevee, which I doubt we're going to get, we can get it here, uh, get Leafy on here. So, let's go down here. Hmm. So, I feel like we're missing something. There's a ledge you can go onto outside of the air, uh, of this area, but how do you get to it? You know, Zigzagoon, I am 10 levels above you. I am so out of your league. Um... 
Oh, here's another thing. Oh, so many items. Eggs attack, sell that for cash monies. Um, here. Didn't I go, did I go here before? So what's this girl got to say? You're no better than a thief if you try to see, steal someone else's Pokemon. You should only throw Pokeballs at wild Pokemon you encounter. Yeah. Uh, a Pokeball. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, did we talk to that little boy? I, uh, I think, yeah, we did. So, I think that's all. But, there's actually berries across here that I quickly want to get. Yeah. So let's get some berries. Very, 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 very good. Um, yeah, here we go. Which ones are these? A person. Yes, I love these ones. Um, because I hate confusion. I always hit myself. So it's good to get the person berries which heal confusion. Uh, so now we have quite a lot of them, which is really nice. And I love how pink they are. So, and I think there's one more lot of berries we need to get, which are just north of here. I bet you a Pokemon's gonna jump. Don't jump at me, Pokemon. Good. And here we go. Some orange berries and some Rost berries. <laughs> I love that noise. This one here. Isn't it so happy? Uh, I shouldn't do that, so this is going to make audio and uh, audio syncing really hard to do. <laughs> um, but yay, now we've made it to the cottage, Mr. Briny's cottage. So let's go inside and talk to Mr. Briny and he's chasing his bird. If your bird needs to get away from you, you should just let it go. Here we go. Let's change the odds around. Now he's being chased by his bird. No, Pico, I didn't mean to hurt you, please. Leave me alone. Ha ha ha. Oh, he's got a picture of fish on his wall. Fish, 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 fish. Uh, what's this picture? It doesn't say anything. Uh, we should talk to them and try and get a trip across the sea. Hold on, lass. Belay that, Pico. Oh, if it ain't Casey, you're the one who saved my Pico. Hey, but you, uh, but we owe you for that day. What's that? You want to sail with me? What's this all about then? A letter bound for Juford? Simply, that'd be no problem at all. Sound, sounds a bit weird this time around. You've come to the right man. We shall hoist sail for Juford at once. Head for Juford, yes please. Juford, we're coming! Angus away! Pigo, set sail, my darling! It's like they got every nautical uh phrase ever and put it into his dialogue look at us like hell yeah that's such a cool sound such a cool sequence i love the music it's so happy and look where we are we're in Juford. Ahoy! We struck land in Juford last. I suppose we'll be heading ashore to deliver that letter to you. What's his name or whomever? If you feel lost or adrift though, try calling the island, calling in on the island's Pokemon gym. Leader Brawley sure knows everyone and everything that goes on in this town. So we finally made it to... Juford Town, a tiny island in the blue sea. Oh, it doesn't zoom out so you can see the town. That sucks. And the music here is so awesome. Alright, well, I think this is a great place to end the episode. On the sh sandy shores of Duford. Uh, so I will see you guys next episode. Uh, and don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this episode. And subscribe because I release this wedlock daily. Plus a few other videos. So I will see you next time guys. Bye!